All right, this is uh, going to be a tough week this week. It's November 25th, Monday morning. I've got to get in the car and do a bunch of running around. I've got to run to Bozeman. And uh, I don't think I'll be back in time to work on the, the clay this afternoon. Um, I'm going to post a video. And uh, this video is from about, oh, I'd say, October 27th, I think it was, 2012. And it was a color. It was the coloring of a bronze that I did of a Hawaiian girl dancing, and uh, it was for a gallery in Hawaii, which it never got there, and uh, the gallery uh, never got back to me. But I always loved this piece, and we sold several of them. Um, it's going to be a tough week this week to get video of me working in the studio because tomorrow uh, I'm going to be here with a, a guy that's going to be working on my heaters in my apartment, uh, the, both the heater downstairs in my uh, studio and up here in the living area where I uh, have a heater, a gas heater. He's checking the filters and things like that. It's been a while since they've done that last, so I don't know what's going to say, what's going to be involved. If I can get in my studio, I will do that. Um, about the only day I can sculpt this week is going to be Wednesday, uh, because Thursday is Thanksgiving. All right, everybody, um, enjoy this video. But anyway, I just wanted to let you know what's going on. I'm a hundred percent. A little after 8, the sun is not quite over the mountains yet. And I'm heading to uh, Bozeman to the uh, foundry. It's, uh, let's see what the temperature says it is. Yeah, 22 degrees. It's come up a little bit since uh, my first recording. So uh, it was 19 degrees about a oh, half hour ago. So it's starting to warm up a little bit, <laughs> if, if you consider that warming up. Yeah, it's going to be a pretty day today. The sun is just getting ready to come over the mountains. And I'm heading out to Bozeman. And a uh, good way to start the day with a beautiful sunrise over the Madison Mountains. Just over... Those mountains is the Yellowstone Park. All right, that's looking east, by the way. Uh, it does the sun does come up in the east? All right, good night. Let's see. I'll zoom in a little bit. Wow, beautiful. All right, I just got to the foundry and uh, they're finishing up uh, a bronze that's going overseas, and uh, it looks great. All right, uh, we're going to be getting started on uh, Island Song pretty quick here, so I'm going to let uh, Isaac finish that up, and uh, I'm going to get my camera set. Plants uh, correcting uh, little tiny little blemishes that were on the piece. Uh, this is uh, what raw bronze looks like. It's uh, white metal. If you buff it up, it'll look like brass because of the uh, brass that's, or the copper that's in it and the tin, which by the way, once I pay for the bronze, I got to pay the uh, cost of the uh, bronze, uh, copper that's in the bronze. And you can see here where he's buffed it up a little bit, how it's shiny to get. One for overseas and one for here in the United States, but anyway, just wanted to show you what they look like in wax. They haven't put the sprues or the pore spouts on them yet, so that's uh, still to be done. It's kind of cool to see them this way. Alright, what Isaac is doing is putting potash. It's a cold acid that he puts on to the bronze. It reacts to the uh, copper 
in the bronze and uh, turns it completely black. It's, it's the smelly stuff that you put on a copper plate in, in art class when you're doing a uh, rubbing or whatever you call those things that I used to do back in school. I don't know if they still do that or not. But anyway, this just turns it all black. It gives it the base coat and then he rubs back in those areas that uh, will be lighter and... Uh, and, and doesn't rub back in those areas that won't be lighter. Quite a bit. 
it's dulled down a lot. If you remember, it was really shiny before. Everything's uh, the wax is is setting setting up on the bronze now, and pretty soon we'll be able to mount it on its base because uh, can't do that while it's really hot. All right, guys, that's it. See you next week. So I'm on this road to Willow Creek and uh, going to dinner now. The uh, cafe that we're going to serves the best barbecued ribs I've ever eaten uh, anywhere. And I've I've been a lot of places. I've been to the uh, bar big barbecue uh, competition in Reno, um, and uh, it's, it's just an incredible barbecue here. The cafe that we uh, eat at uh, it was an old saloon back in the 1800s, and uh, you still got bullet holes in the ceiling that from when the cowboys would get a little rowdy. This is the graveyard here for the town. That uh, yellow building is the uh, cafe right there. There ain't a lot of people here. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to go eat. Bye. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. I'm going to go get going and... Uh, get some things done and uh, I'll see you all next time and uh, if I don't see you this week uh, have a happy Thanksgiving be joyful with your family be thankful that you have your family around you uh, when you get to be 79 like me you don't have the family that you used to have so be thankful If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.